All right guys, so today is a new day and today we are going to be driving the go-kart to see um, one, how well the uh, new carb jet fixed the leaning issue. So the engine was running a little bit lean before because we added the air filter and exhaust. And two, to see how well the new active aero wing works, not just while sitting still, but also actually while moving. So pick today today while well, everyone should be at work, so it shouldn't bother too many people, I don't think. I'm just a little bit nervous with this new exhaust because it'll be actually the first time I've ran this thing with the new exhaust it's been quite a while so that I've actually driven this thing I've been so busy with school and life in general and whatnot so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get you guys set up on a tripod I'm gonna roll this thing out and uh, get it all prepped and ready to drive Alrighty, so I'm gonna get this thing started, and then once I get it started, I'm gonna go ahead and move you guys out into the street. I'm the only person here today, so no extra cameraman. So um, I'll put the camera facing down the street so you guys can kind of see me as I drive by, and then I'll also do some shots um, as I uh, hold the camera while driving the go kart. So let's go ahead and get you guys set up. So I was driving down that side of the road there and the brake feel suddenly got really light and then I realized I had no brakes and it was just because the nut that held the brake rod on slipped off. So basically I've got to be able to find a nut to go over that or find the nut that fell off um, or else it's going to put a premature end to our testing day today. <laughs> Alrighty, so I found a nut. Ideally, I would like a lock nut, but I found a nut and a lock washer, so that should do the trick for now, but I'll go back and um, get all new hardware for that. Like I said in the past video, I want to redesign this whole pedal assembly anyways, so 
that will be a new mini project coming up to uh, further improve the go-kart here. So let's go ahead and start it back up. I'm gonna go ahead and take the camera with me while I'm driving it. It's just amazing. I mean, the wing is one thing, but um, having the new carb jet and the exhaust and air filter, this thing just feels so much more alive. Like it's crazy how those three little mods um, and plus the uh, governor removal, but especially with the exhaust intake and carb jet, because I did those all after the governor removal. It's just amazing how much it livens this car up, uh, not this car, this go-kart up, and it just feels that much quicker and more responsive um, when you give it, give it the gas. So let's go ahead and start it up and take it for a few more test laps and see how it does. neighbors well the brakes worked really good right there so I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys this angle so you can see the wing moving so it still likes to flop over so it's gonna need some fine tweaking gotta wait for traffic
Man, I tell you, this thing never gets old to drive. This thing is just a blast. It is crazy fun. So you can see the wings stuck in a flopped over position. So it's got some fine tweaking it needs to do. And I think I'll make that in another video is like, what, how well is this performing based on this video? Um, and we'll go from there to see how it does. Uh, but there's still a lot of progress to be made with this and I'm just so glad that it's performing well again. So before I end this video, obviously like I just said, I'll talk about the wing and how it's doing in another video. Um, but just in regards to the go-kart engine and the carb jet performance and how it feels. This thing, like I said earlier, it, it feels so much more alive. I don't know how well it comes across on camera, but this thing just rips now. Um, it's amazing how how much those three little simple mods can do um, to really liven up the the feel of the go-kart here. I mean, this thing just rips and you're so, you're pretty much like on the ground, so uh, it, it feels like you're going like 100 miles an hour. Um, so it, it really upped the performance. I'm really happy with uh, the little stage one kit that I got here. Um, I actually haven't even finished all of the mods. I still have to do the new valve springs. Um, and I want to do that because um, since the the governor is removed, it'll kind of prevent valve floats if I put those heavier valve springs on. So that's going to be another video is um, how to install those and how to relash those once you get them installed. Um, only thing I'm not really happy with about, I mentioned in the past video, is this uh, muffler here. So I got this muffler in the kit from OMB Warehouse and the finish on the muffler is just not, it just coming off with the heat now this part obviously gets pretty hot so but you would think they would put a coating on here that could withstand all of the heat because it's a part that is designed to be you know working in high temperature ranges so not too happy with that but aside from that everything is great so I hope you guys enjoyed this little video here where I was uh, talking about just how the uh, car how to one install the carb jet and two how much it improved the performance on the go-kart here and I hope you guys enjoyed the footage of me driving it. A little bit tougher today since I only uh, was the only one here. Didn't have an extra cameraman to uh, film me and uh, as I was driving around. But man, I tell you, if I can recommend anyone that's got a Harbor Freight 212, govern removal, uh, exhaust, carb jet, and uh, high flow intake. It'll liven up the performance of your engine like nothing else. And it was great getting to drive this thing today. I mean. I haven't driven this in months because I've just been so busy with school, you know, and uh, all sorts of just stuff with life. I was sick for the past week or so, so that was no fun. And uh, but it was just awesome to get to drive this thing and rip it around the uh, the neighborhood here because it's so much fun. So if you guys have any questions or comments about the go kart, the the mods I did, or anything about it, please feel free to leave them in the comments below, and I'll be happy to answer them for you guys as always. Um, if you haven't already, definitely subscribe for more uh, go-kart videos and other car, vi car videos on the channel here because there's a lot more where that came from. So thanks guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. I, I,